this is the mobile Twitter application and this is the first native Twitter client for the iPhone and iPod touch so whenever you first open it you want to go to the far right bottom you want to put your username and password for Twitter once you do that you go ahead and hit save and go back to tweets it will load I'm gonna guess the last 10, 20, maybe 25 tweets that you've received. From here, we can select somebody. We can view their tweet in Safari. We can reply. We can send them a direct message. We can cancel. The point for view in mobile Safari in case they decide to post a URL. See that URL is not clickable. So you would have to view it in Noble Safari. Then you would see that link and then you could tap it there. Over in the Messages tab, we can see just of our direct messages. And we can see our replies. We have a timeline tab as well. This is just a public timeline with everybody, even if you're not following them. And then we have an update tab. I believe this blue icon will allow you to maybe upload a photo. Um, I'm not too sure since I only have an iPod Touch, but you go ahead and type what you want to tweet testing mobile twitter and we'll send it once you send it it'll go ahead and take you over to the tweets tab it will refresh and it will show your tweet. Now, there's not too many things that I would like added for here. It's kind of weird that it would crash. First time I've seen it crash. I've been using this for a couple of days, so I've been testing it pretty good. I would like for it to maybe have the at Twitter names maybe linkable on here but maybe it's possible just like the URLs aren't clickable like that at Richard Giles that should be clickable to where I can tap it and go to Richard Giles <laughs> now I would like to see an auto refresh or a manual refresh, I should say, button. I can see that going right there. To refresh, you have to go from one tab and then go back to the Tweets tab. You see it'll load again automatically. They said they will be adding that manual refresh button very soon. Another thing I would like to see, which after reading the developer notes, they say that they're developing, I would like to see this Update tab switchable to where you can type on the keyboard like this it's a lot easier to type with two thumbs than one but again they said that this is coming soon so hopefully this will be updated in the near future very very cool application I've been waiting for a Twitter client for the iPhone and iPod touch for a while now